Hey there, guys. So it's uh, July 4th weekend, and I thought I'd review something that sort of um, defines what uh, old American craft beer is, and that is Sierra Nevada's Pale Ale. Uh, this beer, um, the recipe is from 1980. So this beer is almost 35 years old, and it's completely absurd that it still stands uh, the test of time. Uh, craft beer has absolutely exploded and completely changed and evolved. Uh, the brewing of the hops, you know, and the use of different hops is completely, you know, different. It's just completely crazy how much craft beer has changed and beer in general has changed. And somehow this beer still stands up and um, absolutely awesome. So I thought I'd review this beer. So let's dig in. So the beer comes in a really nice, clear, uh, amber ruby color. Let's get the aroma on this. Uh, there's a nice kind of sweetness. Um, it's a lot of um, bready malt, uh, sugary sweetness, a lot of um, like a ruby red grapefruits or a blood orange kind of thing. A lot of citrus peel. A bit of floral. Let's get the aroma. Uh, let's get the flavor. Cheers. Yeah, this is quite nice. Um, it's um, just a good hoppy pale ale. In the front, you get a good amount of fruit. Uh, in the middle, you get um, uh, this kind of um, floral action, a lot of malt. On the back, you get the spicy note. It almost reminds me of um, some noble hops, uh, sort of like a Czech or German Pilsner. Um, you'll recognize those hops in those beers. Um, so it's that kind of spiciness, a good amount of like floral action, almost like a biting into an air fresher, a lot of like potpourri kind of thing going on here. But yeah, despite that kind of malt and uh, slight sweetness to cut off the bitterness on the back end, it is a clean, easy drinking beer. Um, this in the end is a 5.6% ABV hoppy pale ale, and um, it does not taste, you know, it doesn't sit on the palate as a chewy beer. It's just nice and clean, easy drinking, great summer beer. And um, so yeah, I'm gonna, uh, gonna give this beer an 87. Um, you know, still awesome that a beer after 35 years almost can still stand up um, and be, you know, so good. Um, but then again, we will talk about something like zombie dust, right? Uh, I have a bottle here, uh, empty bottle, sorry. Uh, but this beer is absolutely killer. I mean, it is a Citra single hop. This is a single hop um, cascade. And uh, Citra is a relatively new hop. And uh, you can sort of see how the, the use of hops has completely evolved and changed with an absolutely ridiculous hop bomb like uh, Zombie Dust, you know, just an incredible beer. And also um, how that is separated from this, which is, you know, just a old standard, old use of American hops, of an older hop as well. And um, and this beer is still awesome too. And uh, so yeah, just thought I'd do that. Um, <laughs> so until next time, guys, uh, cheers later. Let me know what you guys think about Sierra Nevada, uh, Sierra Nevada Pale Ale, what you think about the distinction between older recipes and new recipes and the, the, the use between old hops and new hops. Um, yeah, so until next time, guys, cheers, later.